Russia is preparing for terrible provocations in the North Sea. State television in Denmark, Norway, Sweden and Finland has claimed that Russia is preparing to sabotage wind turbines, gas pipelines, electricity and internet cables in the North Sea. As a result of a joint investigation by state television, it was determined that the Russian fleet was disguised as fishing boats and research vessels in the North Sea. It was also claimed that this fleet carried underwater surveillance equipment and mapped important areas for possible sabotage. Russian ships have begun to operate in British waters within the framework of the provocation program. One of the Danish intelligence officers said that the sabotage plans were prepared in the event of an all-out conflict with the West. The head of the Norwegian intelligence service stated that Russia attaches great importance to these plans. The media of the four countries claim that these ships are sailing in territorial waters of the Scandinavian countries and have turned off their transmitters to hide their position. The joint investigation of television stations focuses on the Russian ship Admiral Vladimirsky. Officially, it is an ocean exploration or underwater research vessel, but the report claims it is in fact a Russian spy ship. An unmanned ex-expert from the British Royal Navy is monitoring the ship's movements off the coast of England and Holland. It is alleged that the ship slowed down as it approached wind turbine sites in the region and turned off its transmission and drifted there for a month. Investigating media organisations also draw attention to the presence of masked persons on the ship. It should be noted that the same ship has been seen in the coast of Scotland last year. The ship was spotted entering the Moray Firth on November the 10th. 